we just finished our training session uh, in prep for our very first race weekend in Red Bull Ring in Spielberg. Um, honestly, very excited. So my teammates are here. We're the F1 Academy team for Prema Racing and yeah. Marta? Marta, Say yeah. <laughs> Marta Garcia, yeah. Chloe. Danica Vistavante. Um, so have you guys been to the infamous Red Bull Ring? No, I haven't. It'll be my first time. I've been. Ah, Marta here is the I was, I was here. I, I, was, I was here, yeah. I was here like 2021. Ah, okay. So you must be the most experienced one I mean, in this us, track. Yeah. yeah, in this track. Um, what can you say about it? I mean, it's, um, it's not like a really long track. It has like 10 corners. Um, it's easy to lose time though. Exactly. So, and it's, everything is quite close, like in between like five turns, between between like all the grid, I, 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 will, I will say. Um, but it's a cool track. Uh, it has like long straights as well, really good breaking points. Um, and also like some speed, like f mm, high speed corners yeah, definitely. that you I'd, need to do properly. I'd agree with Marta with, um, it's easy to lose time, especially if you only really have 10 corners and like the rest of the tracks we've been to, you know, it's um, it's it's super easy to lose time on entry if you overslow the corner. That's why if you like watch on boards like um, Kimi or Rafa, everyone that did a time F4, they really maximize the entry curbs and the exit curbs to really rotate the car and carry a speed in. And so I think it's going to be really competitive because it's easy to gain and lose time. So if you make a mistake, easily cars will pass you. But if you're nailing it every lap, it's easy to, you know, build a gap as well. So yeah, I think coming into the weekend, very exciting. I've never been to a track with 10 corners, to be honest. No. Have you not? No. Oh. Track with 10 corners. Oh, That's not that. Yeah. No, this ring has three corners. I've never been. <laughs> yeah. There's, there's yeah. way, like, um, tracks with less corners. So. Yeah. so have you guys, like, tried some Austrian culture yet? Never been to Austria. Really? No. I've been. Oh. I've been quite a lot. Yeah, I like not Austria. Not in Ring, though. I love the schnitzels. schnitzels. Oh, yeah. They're quite good. Yeah. Just yeah. Like, I've never tried schnitzels. Well, you try this yeah. yeah. We'll make you try this week. Oh, uh, <laughs> definitely. You know, um, I think that's one of the funny bits, like coming from Asia, is that the culture is just so different, like yeah. compared to all the Europeans. So it's it's very like amazing, like culture shock when I go abroad. So definitely, I want to try. Yeah. But it's cool that you're like, you've traveled broadly. And you get to experience a lot of culture. Yeah, I think that's one of the best bits about racing yeah. for me is that you see our calendar, we're like going to all these different places and our first race will be in Austria. That's like so cool. I think it's gonna be a really exciting race weekend, especially like because it's the first race of the season. I'm really excited and you know, it, it'd be great. It's great to get into the F1 Academy car and finally race for the first time as a group of all of us. Yeah. We'll see you guys there. We ciao, race? ciao. Bye. <laughs> Where are you guys going? <laughs>